Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are continuing Legacy Challenge. I haven't filmed this cha challenge in a really long time and I'm really, really excited to get back into it. I don't even remember what we did last episode. I'm pretty sure we took care of the Max and Zara situation. You know what? There isn't really a lot going on right now, so I think I'm going to start focusing more on Olive since she is the next heir. And yeah, I hope you guys are excited for this video. I hope you're still enjoying this series. I love you so much. Let's get into this video. Okay guys, here we are back in the legacy household. I'm very excited to be back. Um, I made a few changes. I made a little hallway. Oh, that hallway needs a roof. Shoot. Well, yeah, I made a little hallway <clears throat> between Ren's house and the greenhouse just so it's easier for her to... Where did this door go? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Hang on. Sorry. Which door? It was this door. Okay. And then I also put a roof over our plants because I want them all to be in season all the time. And you guys showed me how to do it. <clears throat> um, and I don't know. I really love how the way that this roof looks. So I am very, very satisfied. Looks like they're all starting to sprout. They all need to be evolved. I love our garden. It's... I don't know, it just makes me so happy. I always think that these are rotten, but it's just garlic. And I think we should probably move them. Uh, let's move them um, over here. Just so that, that blah, 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 just so that it, oh my God, I can't speak. What the heck? So they don't bother Ren. Boom, okay, cool. And then let's add the roof while we are in build mode. Stop. Uh, let's just do, I guess just one of these. Okay, that looks a little bit weird with the thick trim, but whatever. It's all good. I'll fix it later. I don't want to spend too much time because I don't have a lot of time to film today, but I did want to film. So I apologize if this video is a little bit short because <clears throat> I do have to go to class, unfortunately. Um, so yeah, what is everyone up to? Cute. Why aren't you in season? You're considered sheltered, aren't you? All right, it looks like Max is having some water. Zara is going to the bathroom. Ren, oh, what was this? What is this? Oh, no way. That's so interesting. Let's do it. That is so cool. I think April's a good person deep down. And you guys pointed out to me that her and Tegan were flirting at the party. And I didn't even notice that. And then when I rewatched, I was like, what the heck? You guys are right. What the heck? So I don't know. I just kind of feel like everyone is just <clears throat> like, they don't really care. They just are doing their own thing. Oh, <laughs> you look miserable. Um, doing their own thing. And I don't know. Maybe nobody really wants anyone. I don't know. I don't know. It's a very interesting situation. Why don't we... Um, Ooh, ooh, the life decider. I don't think April has a job, so maybe we should decide her life. Let's do it. I hope it tells us. Okay, so it didn't tell us. Okay, well, let's ask her about career. Let's see what job she got. Room attendant at the other sports team. Locker room attendant at the other sports team. Okay, so she chose the athlete career. Interesting. No, no, no. Please don't, don't, don't. No crashing. No crashing. Just go get a table, please. All right, so we're just here. <clears throat> Maybe they can just have some drinks and kind of talk about everything that's been going on. Let's both have whatever this is. Bam. 
Okay, so maybe... Where are you going? No! Stop! Stop, stop, stop! Freaking slice of life, man. Ugh. Ask about children. Okay, let's get her to ask about tr children. So she... Move! I am a parent. Yes, we know. So anyway... Maybe Zara can just be like, okay, so basically, I don't want Max, so you can have him if you want him. I don't really care ever since I heard about what he did to me with you. Oh my goodness, I have never seen that happen before in my life. Holy crap. We didn't even order food. That was weird. <laughs> um, anyway, so, and then April can be like, you know what, honestly, like, I've always loved Max, but I'm just so focused on raising Max Jr. right now that I don't even want Max anymore. And she's like, oh my god, how funny is that? It's like, he pretty much cheated on both of us, and now neither of us want him. I guess he gets what he deserves. How funny would it be if they... Can you please stop? <laughs> I know you're tired, but like... Ugh. So how funny would it be if these two were like, best friends, like, tight? That would be so hilarious. Like, the thing that they have in common is that they both hate Max. So basically, what's gonna happen is... We're gonna have Max Jr. on the weekends, and you're gonna have him during the week. Wake up, Zara! Finally, our drinks are here. So yeah. Aw, she likes it. We're gonna have Max Jr. on the weekends. You're gonna have him during the week. You can come and visit whenever you'd like. And that's that. Dang, she downed that drink so fast. All right, let's head home. Thanks for inviting me out, April. I'm glad we were able to clear things up. It looks like Moose really needs a bath. So, Miss Olive, this is your responsibility. Moose is your dog, so please give Moose a bath. Okay, so, my dear, we have Slice of Life in, and it looks like you're bullied, which honestly doesn't really make sense to me. I kind of see Olive as like a popular person but i guess she's not who what are you you're also bullied okay this really doesn't make any sense like why let's see what happens when we plan a social event maybe like there's like a party we can throw teen study group teen party have the time of your life and a chance to become popular <laughs> this is strange. I don't know if we should like completely play with this or if we should take it out. All right, let's just see what happens. I'm kind of curious to see this. So the teen party has started. Okay, so that was like an instant thing. I did a teen party and I'm automatically popular. Okay, well, that's definitely not how stuff works, but whatever. <laughs> this is Chris Christy, is her name Christy? Sounds like she just self woohooed, which, God, this mod. <laughs> They self woohoo so freaking much. Okay, her name is Christy, not Christine. I've been calling her Christine. I kind of see her as being Olive's best friend. Um, who else does Olive know? That's a girl. Simone? But I don't know. I kind of vibe uh, Christy is better. Just because they, it looks like they're kind of both into fashion. And I think that that could be something that like... <clears throat> they can like talk about so it looks like since I threw a teen party Like even people that I didn't invite come came wait 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 wait. This is um one of your guys sims. I'm pretty sure uh, Emily Manning I found her on the gallery and I had to give her like a little um Makeover but yeah Emily Manning 
If this is your sim, comment down below. I absolutely love her. She's so pretty. Look at all these teens. Holy crap. They're like just showing up. Here's that chick. Girl. <laughs> We've seen some things. What's going on out here? Oliver, come say hi to her. I kind of tried to dress her the same way that she was. Oh my god, they're drinking! <gasps> what? And the chick's taking a mud bath? Yo, this is funny. Why is this so funny to me? And Max is just here practicing his speech. Can you go upstairs and do that so you're not like... Oh my god, look at all these people. Look at all of them. Who's this? Nyla Grimm? Did I make her? Or is she from the gallery? Oh, I don't remember. Who's this? Cute little redhead boy. Who is this? Griffin Mahoney? Mari De La Torre? Oh, here's um Jules. They all have zits. Who's that? Darling Walsh. Okay. Kane Bellamy. I like your hat, Kane Bellamy. Are you having a good time? Savannah came to clean up. Her first party! Oh my god. How exciting is that? I love these three girls. I think this is... This is our group right here. Oh my gosh, this is so sad. I don't know where Oliver is, but he's peeved because why are they picking on me? So all of these teenagers are picking on Oliver. Oh, so he's over here. Oh my gosh, who's he talking to? Oh, he's talking to Simone and Nyla. Maybe these guys are like... They don't like popular kids. Maybe they're like the group that's kind of, um, I don't want to say like outcast, but kind of just like different. And I love that. I love that because I was definitely in the different group. I was never popular or anything like that. So I don't know. I really like this. And maybe since Olive is popular and Oliver is not popular, they'll like drift apart. And they will no longer be as close. I wonder if Zach is popular, if he's bullied as well. Because I think he would fit in good with this group. I like them. They're cute. Oh yeah, Nyla's a loner. Makes complete sense. Just stop. Don't 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 pass out. Don't pass out at your own party. Um come over here and gossip. Who's this? Jalen Leonard. Ren, if you're so tired, can you just like go to your house and sleep? Oh my gosh, she's still out here with her. Uh huh. Oh, <laughs> She just complimented him. Okay, I'm having Olive introduce herself to every sim that she doesn't know. Just so she can know people. Uh-oh, she's got a bladder infection. Okay, and now she's bullied? That doesn't make any sense. Like, whatso- not- none whatsoever, and it's making me mad. I wish this was, like, better. Oh, great. And her responsibility just fell out of range. Oh. Oh my god, she took a pill. No. Oh my goodness, this is bad. This is very bad. She doesn't look bullied. Dang, this is a lit party. Okay, she looks extremely popular. Like, come on, there's no way this girl's bullied. No way. One of you guys said that you were sad that they added bully bullying to The Sims, but they didn't. It's just a mod. So don't worry about it. Okay, it's over. Everyone leave. Bye! Okay, and today is air day, so we need to do some gardening in honor of Savannah. So on air day, we add a tradition for every air. Um, so for Max, I was thinking we could do like... <laughs> be romantic. Ew, what the heck happened to this? I didn't even know hot tubs could break. 
All right, Ren, time to wake up, time to do some gardening. Oh, in honor of Savannah. Um, so yeah, what I, did I already say it? <laughs> I thought for Max's tradition, we could um, do romantic things. <laughs> that would be silly, like be romantic with your partner or be romantic with someone that's not your partner. I thought that would be hilarious because that's definitely something that is Max, so. Can you come over here and repair it without uh, dying and frying? Are you gonna fry out here? Yeah, you're gonna fry, okay. No. Come back over here. All right, looks like everyone is leaving. Oh, my girl. My girl. Get up. What is this? Sad drunk. All this seems to be drunk. Okay, time to sleep it off. Um, looks like Olive is already asleep. Ren is feeling lustful. Uh oh, and he's pissed because of the mess from the party. <gasps> it's fine. Don't worry about it. Just, just clean up. Try not to get too mad at her. <laughs> okay, so Oliver wants to have a boyfriend or a girlfriend, and he wants to go on two dates. So I'm thinking maybe either Simone or Nyla. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> Maybe he can go on dates with both of them, and then he can see who he likes best. I'm so good at sleeping, I can do it with my eyes closed. That's amazing. And, oh shoot! It was the weekend, we were supposed to have Max Jr. And this guy, Zara met at work. He's a proper celebrity, and he's always calling and texting. So I think maybe she could start hanging out with him. I agree, Zara, it's a great day. Let's go out and enjoy the day. Yes, 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 yes. You guys can go and hang out. If I just leave them to it, does their relationship go up or do I actually have to do it myself? Hi, how's it going? He's clumsy. Oh my God, that lady just passed out because of him. Girl. Oh my gosh. Look at her. She's got starry eyes for sure. Oh my god. Oh, he's a bookworm? That's so cute. He's a clumsy bookworm? Who's this? Who are you? Alex Fournier. He looks really cute. Okay, so he's genius, a bookworm, and clumsy, and he's a tech guru. So he must be famous for his, like, tech stuff? I'm not really sure, but, um, I like him for her. Okay, I'm just gonna leave them to it. Let's head back to Olive, and I don't know if she's really doing really, really bad in school, and she's not responsible anymore, and she's throwing parties, she's drinking. She's taking pills, so I don't know. I don't know. I don't see this ending well, so I'm gonna make sure that we take care of her. Let's see, what is she up to right now? She's still drunk. What the heck? Okay, why don't you um, have some water? And then, let's see here. Have you done your homework yet? You haven't. Make sure you do your homework before tomorrow. Okay, it seems to be she's popular now. She had a good dream, nicely decorated. <laughs> and she's sobering up. Good, 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 good. And poor dear has a bladder infection, which is really unfortunate. You really know how to dress. Thanks, Cameron. That's nice of you. <laughs> Olive did her homework. I'm gonna get her to do her extra credit if possible. No, she can't do extra credit. <gasps> That freaking sucks! Okay, no worries. No worries at all. I'm gonna get her to do a... Let's do a large classic painting. Oh my god, can you please stop taking pills? What the heck, dude? I really don't like this at all. Oh, nice, Zara. Okay, so this is what she painted. It's worth $92, which is pretty good for her first painting. Let's have a look at it. Okay, it's just like 
a cute little landscape. Um, let's put it in her room. Right here. Boom. Um, frame. Should we get Oliver a part-time job? I was thinking that might be cool. We haven't done that with our teens yet. Let me see what there is. Babysitter, barista, fast food employee, lifeguard, manual labor, retail employee, drama club, or scout. <sighs> hmm. What's the retail employee one? Six to ten. That's like his whole life, except for Sunday, Monday. Hmm. Barista? 5 a.m. to 7 a.m.? I could see him being a barista. Let's do that. Let's just see. Let's just see how that goes. Oh yeah, we need to build another room for Max. Um, maybe we can just put it right here. Max just kind of needs his own bed. Um, and with a dresser, nothing major. Yeah, let's get him that one. Okay, and then we just need a dresser for him to go right here. He can have... This one's kind of long, but I like it. There you go. Little shirts, a picture, and here we go. Men's care body essentials. All right, that's Max's room. Does he have, um, aww, look. Why is this not working? Oh, there we go. Cute. What is this one? Max and Ren. Aw, and then this is little baby Max. Would it be weird if he had a picture of himself on the wall? All right, let's get Max to claim this bed and go to sleep. Perfect, okay. Ren, could you come over here and repair the shower, please? I think I'm gonna get her to maybe hack her handiness skill. It would make the most sense. Her handiness right now, it's at level two. Okay, cool. Can you come out here and repair the hot tub as well? I don't know if that's gonna like fry you because that seems like a really difficult job, but it needs to be done. Yay, she did it. Wait, what? Why is it still sparking? Oh, this is broken too. Everything is broken around here. So I was thinking that once Oliver and Olive age up into adults, is when we're going to age up Max and Zara. I don't think I want them to be adults for their full time, just so we can like move on to the next generation. So five more days, and then in their adulthood, 14. So yeah, they'll be elders in five days, and then the kids will be adults in five days. I think that's a good way to do it. All right, Ren, what can you do? Can you upgrade anything? Sturdy faucets. A Great way to lower the frequency of breaking. Sure, why don't you give that a try? Have a good day at school. Get up, get up, get up, go to school, go to school. So let's see, ooh, Halloween's tomorrow. Exciting! Let's see what she needs to upgrade the fridge. So we need level five handiness skill, level seven handiness skill. Like the man, the fridge of steel is unbreakable. Oh, okay, so it's automatically unbreakable. For this one, she needs level seven, level five, and level seven. Okay. I'm just gonna get her to upgrade a bunch of stuff that she can around the house to get her handiness skill up. Oh my gosh, $11,000 in bills. Ew. Oh, I thought that was throw up, but no, it's a fruit and yogurt parfait. <laughs> It looks like throw up. Come on, come and sell everything. Oh my God, I wish there was a way that you could just like evolve all, you know? Cause it's very hard to tell what needs to be evolved. It looks like Olive invited over Zach. I love Zach. I really want them to get together. I think that'd be cute. What's well, a lot of you guys shipped this as well, which Honestly, I can totally see it. I got your number to personally tell you you suck. Sweet. It's insane how much money we get from this garden. Now that everything's like evolving and becoming excellent. What are they doing out here? Okay, you're just... Oh. Okay. 
That's cute. All right, girl, do your homework. Ooh, and you have a school project. You have to do it. You have to do your project because you need to get your grades up because, ooh, you're a C student. Well, that's good. I think you used to be a D student, didn't you? I don't know, it was something really bad. Bye, Zach, have a good one. And Ren reached pipe organ level nine. That is so good, she's almost maxed it. I know you don't know me, but if you don't meet me right now, I will be disappointed in you. Sylvian Glade. Is there something that we could find there, like special crops? Cause if there is, we need them for our lot. I think I've only been here once. It's so pretty. Okay, and she's sick to her stomach. So one of you guys told me that if you exit out the random invite, yeah, she's not sick anymore. Okay, so that's good. So, are there crops here? I'm not seeing any, which is really disappointing. What is the point of being here then? Other than the fact that it's pretty. No, we don't want to go home yet. I want to harvest stuff. There's nothing to harvest. There's nothing to do here. Okay, well, this place is pretty pointless, so let's head home. <laughs> that was not fun at all. I thought it was going to be like Sig Sam, where there's like special things that you can take home with you, like the alien plants we have. Guess not. So tired, you guys. So tired all the time. Okay, let's supercell all of this stuff. Oh, well, isn't this cute? She's doing her project and Moose comes to take a nap next to her. It looks like we have a bunch of new stuff to put into Legacy House. You guys were telling me that I don't need to do this. Like, the collections are here and will be here even if I sell everything. But I kind of like having it. It looks cool and it's like a museum. We finished our first case of My Sims trophies. That is so cool. Look, a rainbow poop. Why is it rainbow? Ooh, the smelliest of all the pet poop. How exciting. I don't know what I want to use it on. Okay, so I was thinking since tomorrow is Oliver's birthday and today is Halloween, I thought we could have a costume party for Oliver's birthday, and then we can age him up in this episode and see what his last trait is gonna be. So I'm gonna get Max to cook a zombie cake, of course, cause it's gonna be a spooky party. All right, what was your costume choice? Not 100% sure what that is. Oh, it looks like Moose needs to go to the vet. Dang it! Oh well. We need to get more of those wellness treats. We're spooky. All right, Olive, would you choose? Um, I think this is like the zombie survivor one. What are you making? Resume spooky cookies, are you crazy? Yes. What did you pick? I don't even know what that is. Zara chose a witch and Ren chose... A flight attendant? Can we can we choose something different? <laughs> and why are you attending the bar? All right, whatever. You're good. You're good. You're good. I love Olive's costume. I think it's awesome. But I think I want to change Oliver's because I'm not even really sure what that is. Darth Vader. Are you gonna wear like the helmet and everything? Oh, you are. Wow. Okay. Who's this astronaut? Who dressed up as an astronaut? Tane, that's what's up. Tracy's a pirate. <laughs> All right. No, someone took a slice of the zombie cake. No, it was you. Ugh. Look, we got two pirates in the house. Simone and Tracy, oh my gosh. They probably got their costumes at like a costume store. Oh, what's up, caterer? Hey, I think I think this is one of your guys' sims, actually. I recognize her. Hey, another zombie cake? 
That's fine. Yeah, this is. I'm pretty sure she's a mermaid too. Cute little cheese eyeballs. Caterer, I mean, like, you showed up so freaking late that there's really no point in you being here anymore. Max, like, whipped up so much stuff. <laughs> I think it's time for you to age up. Come on, come make a wish. Aw, oh, you got yourself some cheese eyeballs. Happy birthday! Adulthood! I'm so freaking excited to see his last trait. Oof. Okay, 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 okay. All right. Here we go. I'm pretty sure it's going to be another inherited trait. Booty. Okay. There's so many foodies in this family. It's crazy. Like, come on. Give me something different. Ugly. <laughs> That's a new one that I downloaded. Okay. Uh, where is foodie? Where is foodie? Where is foodie? There we go. All right, Oliver. Happy birthday. Halloween was awesome. 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 Yay. Everyone had an awesome time. I think that Olive and Orange would be a really cute couple. He just seems like someone that she would go for. I don't know. What do you guys think? It's either him or Zach. What are, what are Orange's traits? Because that's a big deal as well. Ooh, cute. <laughs> They're always showing each other stuff on their phones. <laughs> Look at all this! Look at all the eyeballs in the cookies! Oh my goodness! <gasps> Olive! <gasps> You're so bad! What the heck's wrong with you? Giving drugs to other teens? Ugh. That's not cool. All right, I think it's time we ended this party. Got a bronze. We're gonna be eating cheese eyeballs and spooky cookies for months after this. <laughs> we are gonna hit 300,000 very, very soon. That's so crazy. Look, we're about to get there. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys, I'm going to leave this episode right here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in the next one. Love you. Bye.